Welcome to Man Cave Media. Tonight I am checking out a retro Switch game holder. This is going to be a quick video tonight. Uh, this is going to hit you in all the retro feels, especially if you're a Gen Xer like myself. Um, by the way, if you, you know, if this does like hit you in those uh, nostalgic feels as it did for me, it might be time for you to schedule a colonoscopy. Being real, real talk. Schedule it. Do it. Cancer sucks. Anyways, that being said, Go ahead and get this guy out of the box, shall we? And check it out. So I'm not sure if you guys are fans of uh, Austin Evans, but I came across this on a random like tech video unboxing video that he was doing with several products. If you if you watch his channel, you know he, he does um, several like mystery tech products. And this randomly came across on his channel, and I'm like, what is that? I need to have it because it was all kinds of awesome. And you'll see what I'm talking about in a moment. Am I right? Am I right? Right? Yeah, you see that. It's a Blockbuster video case. What? That was my initial reaction when I saw it. And it's licensed, dude. Licensed, officially licensed Blockbuster, and it's made by Retro Fighters, by the way, but we'll get into that in a moment. Let's finish the unboxing. <laughs> so this is a Nintendo Switch game case, as I mentioned. It will hold up to 12 Switch games and four memory cards. And it is awesome. that guy. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my goodness. Look at this thing, man. So awesome. Look at this thing. So the scale of it, it's like a mini VHS. I'm not sure why, you know, if they're going to go through all the trouble to do something like this, why not make it a full size? But I mean, I'm just happy that this exists. Just remember to please rewind. Thanks. The end. This is it on the back too right here. Please remember to rewind. Oh, Blockbuster. Why'd you have to die such an ugly death? So the inside, as I mentioned, it will hold up to 12 Switch games and four memory cards. You can see the slots for the memory cards right there. And then it comes, of course, with the sleeve. <laughs> this is so awesome. So awesome. The uh, the address for the Blockbuster video is uh, on North Movie Street in Hollywood, California. Movie rental. It's just a generic. I might customize this. I might I might make this like a movie that I rented back in the day. Because I mean, it's easy enough to do. I could leave the front alone. You just have to do a custom insert right there. And then do some custom artwork on the back here and kind of make it something that I used to rent back in the day. I think that's what I'm going to do. But anyhow, this part opens up just like a, a cassette tape. Young kids, you have no idea what I'm talking about right now, but just pops in like that. Good to go. Let me grab a couple of Switch games that I have out here really quick. Hold on, I have a couple. So the, this is my current travel case for my Switch, and usually how I store my games, I just kind of leave them chilling in here. I don't have to do that anymore. To have a proper home now. Got to open it already. There we go. Hehehehe. <laughs> Oh my god, this is so awesome. Ah, game's flying everywhere. 
Protect Breath of the Wild. Don't hurt Breath of the Wild. So they fit in there quite nicely. I don't have an extra uh, memory card. I don't want to pull the one out of my Switch right now because it's, it's not off. It's on sleep. So I don't want to freak it out. Um, but there you can see how the game cartridges fit. Everything's nice and snug. Oops. Put it in backwards. Come on now. Oh, awesome. I love it. So right now, this guy is currently in stock over on RetroFighters.com. I will leave a link for that down in the description. Uh, price is $19.99 and worth every penny. Uh, it's very well built. It's got really nice weight to it. Um, again, it would be nice if it was like the size of a full-size VHS. Because, I mean, if you're going to go this far, why not go all the way, right? And make a full-size one. But it is what it is. I'm still happy with it. Hits me in all the right nostalgic feels. Takes me back to a better place. And um, if I decide to customize this and make it, you know, a title that I would have rented back in the day, uh, I'll do a short uh, on that one and I'll, I'll link it to this video so that you guys can check that out. Uh, but anyhow, this was a really cool find and uh, I'm really happy with my purchase. All right, that's all I have for this one. Thank you again for stopping by. Please smash that like button if you enjoyed this video and help feed that algorithm. I hope you have a great evening and like always, thank you for watching.